I start homebrewing at home, got really serious about it there, and then we decided to go professionally and start to never brew. Blue Kettle actually just revolved from a hobby that turned into a business. Started making salsa and going to the very first farmer's market and amazed that people would come back the next week or the week after looking for more. I started uh, making bread and selling it at the St. Albert Farmer's Market. So I had this grand idea that you could uh, make a living doing custom formulating of coatings for uh, companies that needed specialized coatings. Orion Plastics is a manufacturer of custom extruded plastic sheet products. Uh, we import raw materials from around the world and bring them to our manufacturing plant here in St. Albert, Alberta. Toolhound is a tool and equipment tracking software package. It's used primarily by construction companies to track their tools, track their equipment, make sure that uh, they reduce their theft and hoarding. Tempest Fire Protection is located in St. Albert. Uh, we have a crew of approximately 25 guys. Uh, we work in many regions in Western Canada, uh, installing fire suppression systems. We started Oil and City Signs in the basement of our home. The wow moment came, you know, about three years down, down the road where we were getting overwhelmed and the house was getting too small to, to produce everything, so we started looking for uh, a shop here in St. Albert. From humble beginnings, uh, Standard General moved to St. Albert in 1970. 1995, uh, we started Sarasota Homes. Our cake shop has been in business for, since 2012. We've now changed into a full-scale coffee house and as well as a bake shop. In 2008, we set up our own facility here in St. Albert. This year actually marks the 60th year of the St. Albert Gazette being in the community. We currently serve 19 communities across the province. This is head office. We want to kind of bring that whole beer culture to St. Albert where you know, people come and hang out and socialize and make new friends and everybody knows everybody's name. Right now we're working in land development, in real estate, in new builds. And now uh, here we are in uh, Real Park in a building that we've expanded at least once and you know probably have to expand again. We wanted to be in St. Albert because we have been a part of the community for so long. We now have 440 employees um, and a lot of them call St. Albert home base. We had a really good experience dealing with the people at, at the city of St. Albert. They were very welcoming to us. The city of St. Albert has been awesome. The city has also advocated on our behalf to make sure that we have high-speed internet, which is really important for our business. It's a great community that it is supportive of a good business. There is such fantastic support from the local community. The people that live in this community are very supportive of local business. We do get the question all the time from land developers, you know, why would you, would you ever consider building outside of St. Albert? And my answer is there's really no better place to live. We love it here. I would recommend St. Albert to any business to, to come and live and work here. I would encourage anybody to look at St. Albert as a great place to, to be for their business and for their staff. This is a great place to live, a great place to work, and we couldn't be prouder to be here.